In this morning's Health Watch, we're taking a look at recent breakthroughs in the treatment of advanced heart disease. As KPTV's Marilyn Deutsch reports, new medical technology is saving the lives of many who would otherwise die. After five heart attacks, former Vice President Dick Cheney suffered from end-stage heart disease. This is the type of device that Dick Cheney has. But his life was saved by a medical technological breakthrough called the Left Ventricle Assist Device, or LVAD. The pump itself is uh, fully implanted within the chest. The pump is attached to the sick heart and takes over for the left ventricle, circulating the blood throughout the body. Not only do surgeons implant the pump into the patient's chest, they insert something called a drive line that tunnels under the skin then out the body, connecting to a battery-operated power supply, which you wear. Providence cardiologist Jacob Abraham says these devices are saving thousands of lives every year. The patient will leave the hospital and live the rest of their life with the device, or it can be used as a bridge to transplantation. LVADs are also sometimes used temporarily in patients recovering from a heart attack or open heart surgery, just to give their own hearts a rest. Some patients might still be better off with heart transplants, but every year only about 2,000 heart patients receive donated hearts. There are just too few of them to go around. In fact, the demand for donated hearts is estimated to be as much as 100 times greater than the supply. So for many, a pump like this literally means the difference between life and death. 8,000 Americans are now living with these implanted pumps. Marilyn Deutsch, Good Day, Oregon.